everybody, welcome back to The Breach. We are in the final stages of this LP here, which means it's time for custom and randomized squads. We have seven achievements to go. There are three on each of these teams, and the seventh one is to beat the game with all ten squads, so it's just win with these two as well. Once we do all of that, we'll have the 25 <laughs> whopping coins that we need for the secret squad here, and we'll be able to do our final run with that team. So I am taking suggestions for custom squads now. The thread and the YouTube comments are a good place to drop them. If you can come up with something that uh, you'd like to see, let me know. And if we uh, get to it before the LP is done, I'll try it out. Swap mech times three is a good one I've heard a couple of times. We're probably doing that one, so look forward to that. Three swap mechs with Kazakh Pleth the Mantis as a pilot to do damage. Lots of teleporting around. Obviously, they have some weaknesses there, but it should be fun. Uh, another good one is the Flamethrower Mech times 3 I like that one, I've done that one before. A thing to note when you're designing a squad to play, that passive there that's on the Flame Mech, that's not going to appear on the other mechs in this team. That is fire immunity. So that means without the Flame Mech around, these Flame Behemoths are not immune to fire. Same thing for the Rocket Mech having the smoke generator there that makes smoke do damage. Without that, the Jet Mech is nothing. The Jet Mech is for 1 and smoke, just regular smoke. Pretty lame in that case, this mech. So that's a thing to keep in mind. Another one is the nano mech has the healing on kills. Without that, the unstable mech and the leap mech are suddenly really dangerous. They cannot heal themselves anymore. You have to worry about HP, you have to build them completely differently. That's a consideration to keep in mind. I'll be playing random until we are ready for those custom squads though. We'll get the three achievements we need here. I'll randomize the pilot. Henry's here, and we'll be doing Balanced Roll and then Chaos Roll. Chaos Roll is just even more random. Balanced Roll has a few restrictions. I'm not going to allow any two squad members to be on the same. So if we get two Fire Behemoths, for example, or two Blitzkrieg, we'll just re-roll again until we have three completely unique squads on our team. There it is. Laser, Hook, and Rocket Mech. Now we do have the Storm Generator here. I'll sell that probably because the only smoke we'll get is desert tiles and this rocket's blowback. The hook mech with armored status, the laser mech. Uh, that's going to be a little tricky to use. The hook mech will hopefully help us out with that. Make him red because he's going to kill everybody, including us. That looks good. So the achievements we need. Five time pods in a single game. That's a lot. I don't know if there's a way to make these spawn. I don't know if you can control that at all. As far as I know, you cannot. So that means we need to do four islands to try and get five time pods to appear. And we certainly need to collect them all. Hopefully one of those four islands will give us two. Uh, that's the best I can hope for. I don't know if FTL pods count. They probably do. Lucky start is all about getting a good run from the get-go because you're not allowed to shop. No reputation spending. Everything you get comes from the map, which means we will go after lightning bolts, be going after orbs directly from missions, weapons from time pods. That's it. So this sounds like a two island thing to me. You could probably do it on any length, but the shorter the better for something like this, I would imagine. Change the odds, raise the grid defense to 30% or more is not that bad at all. We've done this a few times in the LP. I believe that pilot grid defense even counts towards it, so we might only need a little bit. You can get a lot of what you need off of one island in this. So that's all we've got going on. I'll be going after loot boxes first. And if we can get 30% grid defense while we do it, I certainly will. I'm not going to do lucky start for now. We're going to ignore that one until later. I don't believe this is the squad for that. They don't seem like they're going to be great. We do have high damage and a little bit of car control. We have armored here. But uh, this really is meant for the Blitzkrieg. Without that, I don't know how much we'll get out of that armored status. We need to get this hook mecha weapon quickly. I'll be trying to do these in one or two videos at a brisk pace, as opposed to what we've been doing, because I do have more than one of these runs to go. Where's good for the laser beam? What's a good island to start with? All the enemies here will die in one beam. I think we should go here, deal with the regen. We'll have air support here. I'm going to avoid this one. I still want payout. I still want as much money as I can get. 
We might be able to pull an enemy into the river there. The lake. The two tile lake. Oh, it's all going to explode. How far do you move, Hookmech? Not far enough. It's fine, it's all solved anyway. We do have some good firepower, we certainly have that, so... If nothing else. I'm gonna put him down here. Just for better positioning. I get the feeling that we're gonna be dealing with some grid damage from ourselves on this team. We don't have a way to protect ourselves from the laser. I had a lot of trouble with the laser the first time around. I let myself on fire to pull that enemy into the brink. Of uh, the ocean there. Looks good. XP for the U. I'm going to let that enemy through, actually. Sure. <laughs> it's just a bunch of hookshot mech kills, somehow. I'm not foolish enough to think that the whole thing's gonna go like that, but that went pretty smoothly. This team, I just feel like they have a lot of weaknesses in the enemy control department. They don't have any crowd control. Hook mech is probably the worst one at that. We'll see how it goes. But until I get him a weapon, I'm not going to be satisfied with him. I gotta save that pod before I can destroy the dam. I'm happy to see one, though. Thankfully, they didn't really do anything dangerous here. So we can go ahead and do it. Dang regen. <laughs> the big pool. All right. I do believe I'm going to block the spawn here. Killing the alpha. That sounds good. I'm going to let the other enemy through. Let that happen. Block a spawn and just hang out for a second. I am still missing two pilots as well as the Secret Squad, so there are still things to do. I need to find those two pilots. I don't know of any way to control it, it's just luck. Time pods combined with perfect islands is the best way to get those regular pilots. Just have to find them, they just haven't shown up. One of them is really good and I'm looking forward to showing them off. Hopefully we'll run into them soon. Maybe here. Not quite. Root class weapon. Uh. Can we use that on the hookshot mech? Sure, but to what end? <laughs> One damage and two reactor core price. That's not too exciting. I think I'd rather have something else for my money. I'd rather have ally immunity on my laser, for example. Kill seven enemies. This is the team to do it. We can kill two or three a turn pretty easily. I hope they line up on the left. I was trying to see a way to line up some enemies there, but I did not see one. I have to worry about the buildings getting shot. That is a major concern here. I can't do that shot because of that. There's no reason at all for us to take that hit. We need good lines. We need lines of enemies 
or else we're busted. Finished. That looks like a good line, but it's not enough damage to kill most of them. Two of them will be on fire, though. It's better than I thought. Yeah, that worked out. They're all dead. They are all finished. We have our seven kills. Henry already level two. They're doing all right. They're doing all right. You get a lot of weird synergy with this random stuff. You might run into a great team. You might have one that just can't get anywhere. You can usually still win though, but you might have to make some sacrifices, more than usual. Henry got himself some HP. Is he is he on the right mech? That's the question. I feel like he is. Laser really needs positions. He helps with that. We'll keep him where he is. Defend tanks or the train. I do need grid defense, so this mission's not out either. It's not worthless. Tidal waves coming in. Three grid damage. That's an easy one. The train's probably out. I'm probably not doing that. I tend to go for stars because stars are just as good. We're not doing the no reputation thing, so... We don't have to worry about that just yet. Let's defend those tanks. The rocket mech is really good. I'm really happy to have that one. Heart and soul of this team, actually. The beam's alright, but it's harder to use. The rocket mech is really on target all the time. What's my move here? We're gonna have to smoke him so that it can't do anything. I sort of want to bring this over here so that it's safer. We can fire the backdraft smoke. It does do damage because the passive smoke boost is on that mech, as I said earlier. It gets regenerated though. They're lining up nicely for me. I can get two kills. We're almost to where we can uh, get our tanks online. That seems good. With the tanks online, we no longer have an issue of defending them. They'll be able to protect themselves. Smoke here will kill you. Fire here. Yeah, we can do this. We can shove him around and kill him. I might sell the electric smoke. Maybe I shouldn't though. It's not something I should sell because it's only worth one unless I have something to put in its place. That's what I think about it. Until I have a better slot for that. A need for that space on that weaponry. The money's not worth it. It's okay to have some smoke damage. But it's so minimal. Mech movement. Scorpion leader. It is way back down there in the corner. It can't do anything. It's probably going to step in front of me here and I can beam it. This looks fine to start with. It can't do anything, so I expect it to just try to get in position. It didn't even go the right direction. I can pull it over and blast it once if I feel like it. I sh probably should do that. It's got a lot of HP, I gotta start burning it down. Let it grapple whatever it wants to. I can kill it right now. If I do that though, we'll take grid damage. If I let it go and pull my mech out, 
we can kill this dude instead. But I actually need to kill that enemy. How hard do you hit? Yeah, you don't hit hard enough. That's a problem. Better back it up. We can do better. This is still the right play. We just won't hit the boss this turn. We'll kill both of these enemies instead. Get him by himself, block one of the spawns. It'll be just the boss. Maybe we can pull off a shot now. That firefly. We could pull it here, but I can't shoot it with the laser. I could smoke it because it's grappled my friend. How am I going to do that four damage to that boss? I wish we had smoke immunity. Hmm. I hate to let him go. He's worth so much to me. Dead. That four damage. He's worth the grid loss. He is. It's worth this. Man, I hate killing my own grid. But the smoke happens before the regeneration, so we get the kill. Camilla, you would have been nice just a minute ago. That always seems to be the case with you. Welcome to the team. We have the opportunity to do the thing we did with smoke the first time, the electric smoke drop. That's not a bad idea. We're dropping Fenrir the pilot here. You are now immune. Do I want smoke drop? It's free. That's such a good weapon for this. We can sell the shock cannon instead. And that would be the one move that the hook mech would always do. I'm gonna buy a smoke drop. They're gonna give it to me, don't turn that down. I'll grab the power I'm missing. We need 15 grid defense to get our goal here, so I need to buy a few. But we're not in any rush for it. We can sell this as well. We don't need that either. Get the start on that mission. The new enemies are Burrower, Charger, and the Blobber. What do we do? Well, let's assign our cores first. And get Rocket Artillery upgraded. That sounds great. Let's do some damage with that. This is not too bad. Laser should tear up that boss. Down over here we have the upgraded health on these enemies. That's a little bit more annoying right now. We can't really deal with these other two until we get a little bit more firepower. We're almost there. It'll just be a little close. Earth Mover mission. Hopefully one of them lines up right here. The Earth Mover will fill in these two gaps. Leave these. I didn't expect it to, but you can dream. We can smoke the Earth Mover and it will stop this dumb idea of smoking everything.
I'm deciding which set of enemies I should smoke. I think the only way to avoid all of my problems here is to smoke here. And that allows me to come over here and do this. They now explode on death. can't kill any of them because of the way it's going to blow up. I suppose I can. I wish I could stand here and rock it. That would be great. Cannot do that though. Do I take grid damage? If I pull here. I can kill one and leave the other. I hate to do that, but that grid damage seems like it must happen. The last two enemies I need... Oh, resist. Last two enemies I need are on the field. Lucky resist is nice. Can't complain about that. Beam forward. Rocket forward. This worked out. A little bit of fortune there on the 17% block. <laughs> Hard to believe, but you drove them off. Yeah, somehow. One more core. Throw it on the pile, let's see. Movement is good. I obviously want this upgraded now, that's a big deal. This too, at four damage would be nice already. I think the rocket mech is going to be a big deal for me, I need to upgrade it, so let's just get to work on it. Train defense. Those bombs are not too bad. The bottom left one, I can pull up to the top left and it will be very safe. This is a good mission because of that. Because I can pull that off like that. If I couldn't, I would think this was hell. The artillery will explode, but at least they're far away. Here's a time pod. Of course they are right in my way. I've been using this right away, and I think I might do it again. Do I have a better move? I do. I can do this. Get rid of the smoke, kill that jerk, and pull that bomb up like I wanted to. That works better than wasting my smoke bomb too early. We can kill them now freely.
I think I like the idea of blocking the immediate vicinity of those cities. I should have moved first, though. I don't like where my hook mech is. Oh my. This is going much worse all of a sudden. <laughs> oh, jeez. Wish I had the turn back. We lost one of the bombs. Perfect Island is ruined. He'll kill himself on it. The fool. That's it for that turn, though. They're done. Oh, you, I didn't think that that would uh, shoot the, the pod, but apparently it does. That's interesting. I thought it would go right over top of it. That's not happening. We need those pods. Perfect Island, whatever. We need those pods. Chen? Not the pilot I'm looking for, but... Not too bad. They have the same stats. A little less XP, but we have sidestep to bonus on the rocket mech. That's gonna be nice. Go ahead and get some damage on that, too. Full damage. Two lightning bolts. Gotta go towards our grid defense thing. Let them grapple us. That's what they want to do. Hopefully they go after Camilla. Yes. Not quite there on pulling that enemy in front of his friend. Almost. That 4 HP damage is really good. Kill both of them anyway. <laughs> I've never seen him say that before. Good work, Henry. Again, good work, Henry. Already maxed out. I don't really care what he gets. Grid defense moves towards my goal. And we might actually be able to get that achievement already, if that's the case. That enemy will die to the water. As well light some smoke up. That's not necessarily true, actually. The smoke might be bad for me. It has already gotten in my way a little bit. You can't shoot through it, so it's just a hindrance for everybody. Mech reactor. All right, give me that movement. Terraformer mission. Destroy two mountains. Neither of these are very hard with this team. We haven't really done the destroy mountains mission much. Let's see if I can pull it off. It's been a little while. My rocket mech can shoot it from any of the back tiles. There's two crumpled mountains. Three, actually, to pick from. That's not such a great move. You can kill this enemy instead. Get rid of one of the mountains. Suck him in. I decided to take damage instead of killing that guy. The bomb scion. I hope that's not a mistake, but I did get rid of the mountain.
I'll let him do it. I'm surprised armor didn't block that. I thought it would. I thought it would take zero from that explosion. Dodging the web. The three damage hit on you. Why don't we go ahead and get rid of that bomb scion? I think it's had its fun. It's starting to mess me up. I can no longer take those many hits. We'll get that mountain next turn. We'll block a spawn and kill that hornet. It'll just be two on three. I'll have time. That one missed, so we're good. We're clear. Mountain's destroyed. Enemy defeated. And we'll have some smoke. Time for the slime. I'm not thrilled about the placement of buildings. This building not being in line with these makes it a little rough for me. Would like that uh, leaper to grab Camilla there though. If I can cause that to happen, that's good. I want to be able to zap that slime safely, which means I need to come from the right side, shooting left. They didn't do what I expected at all. We can still blast them, though. Is that smoke? I think it is. That's really going to light up the bottom. They're going to have to come around. I was gonna shoot that way. Uh, now I'm thinking I'm gonna shoot this way instead. I could get through there and destroy that slime. It's all about crowd control though. I'm gonna make more enemies for me. It might block the spawn if I'm lucky. Or I could dispose of this. I think I might reset turn if this doesn't go well. It went well. We blocked the spawn. Those two are dead. That went really well. Back up here. That's enough slimes destroyed that it counts as a boss kill, even with one left. They're not really any trouble at all, they've killed themselves. That boss will take care of himself too. That alpha, down he goes. finished. If not for that one bomb being surrounded. Would have had another perfect island. I only got six stars from that, though. Safan, you can stay here. We can get that uh, achievement right now if I feel like it. I don't want any of these weapons. I'm not in any rush to get 30 grid. Like I said, that's not much, so I'm going to get two cores instead. Use it for the damage that we desperately need for these last islands. I'm 
we really need this laser power up. I hate to take movement away from you, but I think I'm going to do that for now. Try and get that back later. I hope I don't regret that. I'm starting to regret it already. I think instead I just want the storm generator upgraded. I can't do that yet though. We'll get it. We'll get it. This will be all right. This will work out. I'm gonna go with that. The armored one scares me more than the HP one, and that spider is really annoying. So I'm 50-50 on which one of these is harder, and I tend to do the harder one earlier because it gets really hard later. Do I want to deal with bombs that have armor on them? <laughs> or digging enemy versus spider with snare. We have Camilla. To block the snare, I can try and use that to my advantage. The burrower is a real problem. Let's just do ice. I still need three time pods. Looking for that break. There. In the water there. Is a time pod from an FTL pilot. Let me see something here. Yes, it will tell us if that counts or not right after I open that up. I want that. Man, what's gonna happen here? I think the spider will launch here and I'll be able to uh, shoot forward. I'm hoping these enemies all go after Camilla there. That would be the best scenario if we can attract two enemies to waste their turn on her. Looks like no. The answer is no. That's all unfortunate business. We might have to use the smoke already. And I do believe it will kill you. Oh, you're immune to smoke. That's interesting. It's gotta happen. I have to do it. It's the only way out of the situation here. I hate to let the spider enemy go. But I think I need to do this. We're not even going to get that kill. I wish we would, but it's just not there. Not on fire. Mech has iced himself, the robot. That's interesting. This is a better turn for me. You can shoot down here, scare an enemy off. I'll take a hit, but that's okay. Can't do anything about this guy down here. The hook mech has no value here. We can pull the laser mech down some. Could have pulled my rocket mech out so it didn't take a hit. But I didn't feel like that was a good place for it to be. Finally getting advantage of that web community. I don't know how I'm going to get this FTL pod. That would open it up. We'd take some serious grid damage for that move, but it would open it up. It's actually bad for me that the uh, mech froze itself because it doesn't drop a mine now.
Looks like we're taking some grid. I can't do anything about the two in the bottom left. It's too far away. It's just way out of position. The FTL pod matters more to me than anything that's left. If I can grab that, that would be great. But how can I get that done? They're wasting their turns. This is my chance to do it. It's all coming together, yeah. It sure is. We took two grid, but we got our FTL pod, and I can find out if that counts towards this or not right now. We have two. Waterlog can't do anything. If that counts, then we probably have it. It'll be nice to have an FTL pilot anyway. Level up for Camille. Mafon. <laughs> That's a lot of energy. Really good pilot to see, actually. Do we have three? We do, that counts. All right. In business. Chen, you are the weak link here. I like sidestep, but I don't like sidestep that much. Sorry. Give me that damage upgrade. The health is gone, so we don't need it anymore. It means we have two cores to spend. I lose movement for this. That's always scary. That damage bonus, though. Hopefully we'll be okay with three movement. I, I gotta fix that as soon as I can. Reason to defend both robots. Usually is... Not too bad. The other one is seven enemy kills. That should be doable as well. I want this robot to shoot at us, and we can just get out of the way. That's what I want to see. Did. We have our choice on freezing either one of those. I might freeze the burrower. Dang burrower is really annoying. Oh, I can kill them both. I didn't think about that that's gonna kill my friend. Uh, well, not my friend, my enemy robot there. I gotta pull him out. How much do you hit for? Three damage. Let's reset. I can do better. I don't need to take that damage, I don't think. Maybe I do. Oh, I need the position there. This ice, that kills it. Okay, that's fine. We got it. We kill the burrowers again. You will not shoot him. Yeah, yeah, this is, this is fine. Four movements. You come here and freeze that one. Pull this one in front over. The burrowers are actually in the positions I need here. That's the play. Spider launcher coming in. That's fine. It froze me right where I need to be to do my job. Flashed you this way. Laser mech not doing anything this turn. I'm gonna drop that smoke here. Finish that guy off. I should have shot upwards and killed the egg sack. I forgot it was there. 
there's no reason for that enemy to be on the field now. Oh well. It is what it is. I can kill it now. They really want to mess up my positioning here. It's going to unfreeze the robots, both of them. What am I going to do about that? I need to pick a target for my rocket mech here. I think it's this one. I want to do something else with the other two. Oh, that's fire. That's gross. I should have backed up a step. I'm gonna have to deal with that and not be able to attack. Oh, I will. I'll be okay. I have one health left. I'll be fine. Just a little burned. Slightly crisp. Mission complete. Henry's okay. 